ladies and gents, I am the Rev, and this is the Beginner's Guide to Osiris New Dawn. And in the last episode, we went over the various minerals, other such things you can pick up. We built our first little save point, and now we're continuing on with the next steps. So, what we're going to do is, because we're going to be building out now in that direction, we're going to build our habitat on this side. So, we'll just get rid of these because, again, these were nothing more than barriers for monsters. Next thing we need to build is going to be our forge. All right, I need iron, titanium, and plutonium. Now you get plutonium from either inside the current mines or the easier way is just wait for meteorites. You'll know, you'll hear them, they shake the ground. I'm sure we'll come across them. Up. Oh. speaking of which. And they have plutonium and lithium. Now, I did go into the other mine on the other side there that I've shown before. It is where the... Oh, what do you call it? Uh, all the trees are. It ran that a little bit. Now, first thing you're going to make out of this is a conduit bender. All right? So you just need a little bit of steel. Already made one. And I'll show you why. You saw how many wax that other one took? Watch this. Boom. You can just... And this is because of the density and hardness. It also works as a better weapon if stuff starts coming at you, the bugs. You can fight them off with it. It's not too bad. But you will definitely see a difference with this. Heard a bug. Oh, there's one. Hey, dude. It's all good. Of course, you want to kill these larvae guys because... Oh, no. Well, normally they give you meat. One thing you always want to look for, if you don't get meat... Get rid of it. And the next thing you're going to want to build uh, is a shovel. And the shovel is just aluminum and steel so that you can make glass. Right? Glass is real easy to make. Wherever you are, doesn't really matter. Now, I've done this on all the planets and you always get sand. That's just a given. And it's an easy way to get your science up. Stand here holding the button for a bit. And then, you can make whatever you need there. It's, uh, two sand makes one glass. And just in case I didn't show it, I don't think in the last episode, makeshift bandits, the red fern tree berry and the blue palms. With the blue palms and the fern berry, you can make masking tape or with the cloth bundle and the fern berry, you can make more patch tape. All right, so next up we need to build. We start building out going to be our chem station. Why the chem station? Because you need rubber for this next one and you can make rubber in the chem station. You can't get it from trees anymore. They changed it. But to get it to work see it has no power. So you're going to have to make a small solar kit. So we'll make one real quick here and you need carbon now carbon you can find 
all over the place in the experimental branch, or here you find it where the giant bones of the worms are. It's called like the worm cemetery, something like that. And then once you get it, you then have to place it And we'll put her right there. And you hit F, it shows the range, which is perfect. And in your chemical station, you see we can make rubber, hydrogen and chlorine, and plastic. Now I will show you guys in this video, we are gonna go I've got enough barrels from running around. I'm going to go show you what all the gases are, what they look like. Because that is definitely needed. But up next is the printer. And the printer's got all kinds of good stuff. This is the most important right here. Inflatable dome kit. We're going to make one of those. Because that is a much safer alternative to what we currently have. And then we get the weapons. The only problem is I haven't seen lead on this planet. And I haven't seen diamonds yet. Now before you could get those in the mine um, that has trees around it. Just a random generator. But that's okay. Because once we get everything built and we head to outer space, the first thing we're doing is we're going to go to the moon, Lunatari, because up there they've got zircon for zircon plate, which you'll need for a whole bunch of different tech stuff, uh, diamonds, um, obsidian. I mean, they've got it's got everything. All right, and then. I might have to push that out a little more. Next. Got to build a gas tank. Oh, that's big. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to push everything out here. Okay, hold on a second. Okay. Now the question's going to be, I would assume, yeah, okay, so you can see around the front it says fuel type. And then a liquid tank. And of course, you always want to make sure nothing's in there before you do this so you don't lose anything. But now we can start our habitat. something in there. Oh, copper. Oh, I gotta make a... Oh, look at that. Cool. All right. I 
and get our most important thing that we'll be using the most. Now, a few of the things I wanted to show you guys about. What you can do. Oh, where to go? There it is. What you can do. Now, supposedly, you can stack these. There we go. So, again, they make a great wall. And this is just to keep us safe. So now, I'm going to run around, and I'm going to show you guys what all of the gases are next. So hold on. Real quick, and when it comes to carbon, and you'll need a lot of it. Always look at the base of these giant stones. That's where you find it. Haven't found any lead, though. Perfect. All righty. So, we've got a couple of things here we need to talk about. You guys are definitely going to want to take and salvage every time you see. But first, we have fluorine. Get out of here. You son of a... Go. So we got our fluorine. Oh, come on. We have our chlorine. And whenever you see these, the satellites, definitely want to make sure you grab them. Look at that. 13 circuit boards. I have that turned way up. Wire. Steel. Batteries. Barrel. More circuit boards. Okay, so hold on. I'm going to run around and find... Uh, that meteor sitting on top. More gas. They're normally in craters. Alrighty, folks, you can see right there are all the trees. This is the one we used probably the most that I've seen, which is hydrogen. Alright, that's one. And then if we head into the trees, that'll be our last type, uh, I think. I don't know, we might come across more. This will get you definitely started. So, this should be oxygen. Oh, no, nitrogen. Okay, oxygen is the last one. And, let's see. Yep, that's nitrogen. So, yeah, there is one more that's oxygen, but... Ooh, I got a whole bunch of... I'm going to run out of room. <laughs> and since we're here, just to have a little bit of fun... Let's go hit these. The Alpha Mine. All right, got to turn your light on. And I don't know if this is going to be kept with the game, but always inspect that dude. You'll get 
a little key card thing. Come down here. And then check out the loot. See what we get. Do we get anything good? Let's see, I'll take that, this, this, and this. You can grow those in your farm, and those are what you use to make more of the masking tape. Ooh, this is, see, that's what I was looking for, is lithium. Don't need more barrels, and I got plenty of batteries. And we are going to need um, the cloth bundles for making uh, our little dome. Down here in this corner here, I'm filling up my food. But you can get all kinds of cool stuff. Um, but you always want to check them. Okay. Now we're going to fight us some bugs. Rich mineral outcropping. I'm sure they're in here. See, there's some plutonium. You know, that's if I can make it through without being swarmed by them for once. But I'm going to show you guys if it spawns. Oh, hello. Bottom's dropping. If you can, try and get your back to a wall so they can't hit you from different angles. Ooh. Get it. Who's your daddy? Mm-hmm. All right. So. Ugh. This is the only spot I've ever found diamonds on this planet. And that's if it randomly spawns. And it didn't. why you bring these and we good now these big guys can give you um, all kinds of crap yeah, six laser cells so they've eaten astronauts But since their latest update, I haven't seen the diamonds in here, so. What's that? Oh, lead! Oh, I need that. I guess there is lead in here. We just have to find it. Let's see, what can I get rid of? Oh, we'll get rid of that meat. I'm not going to use it. Cool. 12. Awesome. That's going to make things a lot easier. We should be able to make our gun now. We'll just clear out everything as we head out here. Don't need any more of those. You guys I'll take.
You ain't following me? Sheesh. Slingshot effect. I've never found anything in the sample racks yet. Sometimes there's stuff in there. Again, there is one more mine that we haven't looked at yet. Alrighty, folks. So, in the next episode, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be building... Our habitat we have everything I think which required and then once you build this yeah you can build a hallway the barracks biodome a lot now laboratory we're gonna have to build a bunch of crap before we can get to the laboratory which sucks because that's the thing that makes all of our vehicles and then we have an upper story habitat we can do too all of these will unlock as we go so, according to the devs, this is going to get turned into something else. Maybe bonuses for us to help us do better or some such thing. But tune in next time. Keep your heads down. Your astronauts up. And I'll see you again real damn soon.